At the young age of 23, Carissa Moore has already carved a spot as Hawaii's most accomplished female professional surfer. With three world titles under her belt, including wins at the prestigious pipeline, there's not much more Carissa could ask for. But her humbleness and dedication to strive forward has always kept her on the right track with strong family support and a solid mindset. I've been really blessed to grow up in Hawaii. Uh, it's paradise. There's pretty much no better place in the world to grow up as a surfer. And my dad has been there from the very beginning. He, you know, he pushed me into my first wave and he's never left my side. He's my rock. And you know, it's definitely been challenging to find that balance between having him as a dad and as a, as a coach. We've definitely grown and the balance of our relationship has gone a lot more smooth, but I definitely still have the days where, you know, we clash and stuff. But the funny part is, is I want him there probably more than he wants to be there. I just, he makes me feel comfortable. He knows which buttons to push to help me perform at my best. So I wouldn't be where I am today without my dad. My dad has a lot of input into everything that I do. He's really smart, really creative on how he looks at things. So that's been a huge asset. So far this year, Carissa has lacked the winning results she strives for but consistently placing near the top has kept her in the hunt for a title going into the back half of the competitive season. I feel like every year there's new challenges and um, new things to learn and I've really been embracing the idea of self-awareness and just kind of trying to let things go and go with the flow and validate myself. That's kind of like <laughs> the theme of this year. and. Um, you know, so far competitively, I haven't won any events or really gotten the results I wanted, but I feel like I've been the happiest with my performances that I've ever been. I feel like I've been really pushing my surfing, so I'm super stoked with that. I'm just, I'm loving what I'm doing, and I'm really happy both in and out of the water. I just got engaged to my boyfriend, so I'm super stoked. And I'm really excited for the next half of the season. We'll, we'll see how it goes. Every event is a clean slate, so I feel like I just have to work just as hard, prepare just as hard, and I never want to lose that because you got to always stay on your toes. I really do feel like I'm performing at my best, but I haven't seen myself on top, so I think it's been hard for me to validate myself. When you win an event, that's what's remembered. You know, all the other performances, unfortunately, are left behind, and it's being able to, you know, look at myself and give myself a pat on the back, learn from it, and move on. And yeah, work hard, enjoy the hard work, and always be determined and passionate about what you're doing. But there's a certain point where you can't control everything and you have to like, just let go and, and have faith. Win or lose, Carissa recognizes her passion and the opportunity she has been given to live this life of a professional surfer, mm -hmm. not wanting to waste any moment of it. Finding that balance is so important between life in the water and out of the water. I mean, I don't think I would perform the same if it was all about surfing. So for me, it's great to get away, get my mind off of surfing and competition. And for me, that when I come from a place of love, that's when I perform at my best. And so I think the rest of the results will fall into place. I mean, when it comes down to it, I just, I love what I do. I love being in the ocean every day. I love waking up with a purpose and a challenge to be better and to surf better. And I love the challenge of competing as much as I hate losing. Like the idea of working so hard for that one moment and seeing it all pay off is just something that I kind of crave and I strive for. And I think for me, like I, I just love performing. I love seeing people stoked on what I do in the water. And you know, it's an amazing life. I've gotten the opportunity to travel the world and meet awesome people. And just the experiences I've had from surfing just makes me want to do it more. So. Yeah, I'm really enjoying it. I'm, I'm learning so much and I feel like I've grown so much as a person through this whole journey.